everybody, it's Robin from Talks from the Heart. In this video, I'm gonna show you my catch-all um, planner pouch. I've been using this for a number of months, if not all of 2023, and it's really been working. And I just wanted to share with you. So this pouch is from Tokyo Pen Shop. It's a leather pouch. I don't think it's expensive for what it is. It's beautiful. Um, so I will link Tokyo Pen Pouch not Tokyo Pen Pouch, I will link Tokyo Pen Shop. If you haven't shopped with them before, they're a great small shop um, with a lot of really cool stuff. And um, so I've got my Sweet Quiet Designs Planner little charms here. And um, I'm just gonna keep it that way. I've got a lot of planner charms and um, I'm thinking, I like it this way. Love this because it opens up so, so wide. Now, I have shown in the past lots of different ways to organize your stuff, but this is what's working for me right now. And what I love about it is it really has all the bare necessities um, for exactly what I'll, I would need for any general planning session. And I can pick it all up and it has everything. Carry it to the other room where sometimes I pull out the TV tray and watch TV and do a little planner session. Um, or even just decorate my journal. So let's um, let's empty it first. Let's do that. Let's empty it, and then we'll put everything back together. Now I'm somebody that likes kind of a chaotic mess, and what I mean by that is I like to dig for things. I like the sound of I like that sound, and so um, yeah, this actually goes here. cloth and paper it fell off okay so I traditionally don't change much of what's in here in this inside zipper pocket you can see how pretty these are and they have so many different colors um, I have a paper clip paper clip sorry about my band-aids um the weather is doing bad things to my cuticles and then I have this clip from sweet quiet designs I just keep it on hand because it does um, hold the papers down and I don't want it to get too scratched so I have it inside this pocket the inside pocket and then in the outer side pocket I just have a photograph I'm going to bring it up close you guys pause it and um this is something that um, My Life Mitch showed a long time ago about how you can do like days of the week heading. And it's from at M-A-K-I-B-U-N-G-N, -N, if you want to look it up. So what I did was I just did a screenshot and then I just printed it out with my Canon Ivy and I keep it close to me because if I want to get kind of creative with the headings that I use on a page, then it's right there. The other thing that this has done is it has made it where I can just have this on the top of my desk and I don't have to go digging into different pencil cans, drawers, anything. It's all right here and it's it's been working great. So I have a pair of scissors that I got on AliExpress. I just say any small pair of scissors. I wish it had a, like a little sheath to protect the, the, it, but I don't, I don't really poke myself with that. I have um, some cheap washi tape that I keep in there in case I want to put down a stencil. I'm having some issue focusing. I have this little cutter um, X-Acto knife that I can use to cut washi or stickers or anything like that. And I just keep that in there. I have, and I think they're security blankets. I actually could get rid of this one. This is a tweezers. I'll, I'll put it in my drawer. Um, I have long tweezers that came in a sub box from cloth and paper, really pointy. And then these are my favorite tweezers. Um, I get the um, I get the really pointed ones um, at TJ Maxx in the beauty section. I have these little um, Pilot Friction stamps. This one is the uh, the flower. And then this one is the birthday cake, and I actually need to put this to use setting up my 2024 planner. Then I have this from Krell's Creations, and it's a ruler, which also makes for a very good washi cutter. Um, right now, I am currently looking for my metal washi cutter, but I usually have, this is where I keep all my metal ones. Let's just pick one. Um, oh, Christmas is coming up. Oh, I have a fall one. Ah, yay! See, this was this is what happens to me when I do videos. Is I just 
find things that I've been looking for. So this is just a metal washi card. I don't know where the other one went. It's somewhere buried in a pile to my right. Um, all right, so I have some mono adhesive. I use the dot, these are refillable. Um, you just go like that and you can buy the refills cheaper than you can. And um, I just keep that close for if I have to um, glue something down. Then I have some Tombow correction tape. I also get this on Amazon. Anything I mention on Amazon is in my storefront. You just follow the main link and you'll find it. So I have a permanent marker, a permanent marker pen for when I use um, like vinyl stickers. My favorite pen from Walmart, it's just a gel pen. It comes uh, in a, like in a pack of four. And then I have a Pentel liquid gel ink in a 0.7. And then again, an S gel Sharpie 0.7 that um, I get from Walmart. I, I got to have a lot of pen choices, even those are both 0.7. And then I've been using this to stencil out my um, 2024 uh, planner and it's been working great. So this is the Hobonichi pen that you get with your order. And it is, I know I'm supposed to know the name of it, but its it's been working great and has three colors. Now, usually I have a Kalena in here, which um, right now I need to order refills, but this is what they look like and they're great. But that's it, you guys. That is pretty much everything that I keep in my catch-all planner pouch. And look at this, look at how compact. I can throw it in a tote bag, I can um, carry it to another room and it's it's just fabulous. Again, there are so many ways that you can stay mobile with your um, basic essentials. You can use like a tray, um, you could even use just like a pencil can. It doesn't have to be, um, it doesn't have to be a horizontal type pouch, but any pouch at all. And um, I just I just keep my essentials. Now, I used to also just never use this. I would just um, have it ready on the go, but I found that it's just so much easier to just have it on the top of my desk. And then this is the backside. Have it on the top of my desk and I just, um, I just grab from this. So I hope that you guys, um, I hope that this was fun. I hope that you got stimulated to maybe say, yeah, I've been meaning to do that. I've been meaning to set up a to-go um, a to-go pouch and um, they're so 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 much fun and easy to use I just thought of this let's see if this fits because I have this this is like the gum holder with all my mini stickers yep so if I wanted to do some functional planning and I wanted to take this on the go um, you can put little cases in here and um, they will fit so I just get these I think they're like extra gum and it's like a little pouch that fits um, small mini um, sampler type size stickers. So you can, you know, this, look at the gusset on the bottom of this thing. It's big and it holds a lot. So, all right, I think that's about it for today. I hope everybody is having a great day today. I want to thank you so much for watching. Give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and always enjoy today. Bye, everybody.